Hi guys! So I've been working on a couple of different projects for Hoop City and they're gonna launch hopefully this week if everything goes according to plan and the first one that I'm gonna launch is called the Homestay Project. The Homestay Project is a program that will help us to connect with other Hoopers on a personal level, C connect th with them personally if and when we should ever be visiting their hometown. So for example, um, I had the lovely, lovely privilege of meeting a great hooper named Lori in Hawaii and she actually let me sleep on her couch and sleep sleep at her house. And it was incredible. Like, I was just on vacation and we got to hang out and I got to show her hoop moves and we had a blast. She showed us around. It was great. And I mean, I, I never would have had the same trip had I not met her. It was incredible. And it just makes me think how many other opportunities there are for connections that we can make with hoopers around the world where we have an opportunity where we're, we're visiting a city that we, we're new to, we don't know anybody, and, uh, and maybe we want to connect with somebody. We can, we can now, with this homestay project, what'll happen is that when you fill out your profile information, there's a series of questions that you get asked. And one of those questions will be, are you willing to, um, to put a hoop, have a hooper stay at your house should they visit your hometown? So you can, choo you can choose to opt out and not be included in, in the directory at all. But if you do, if you would be into that, and you can always say no too if you're out of town or have parents visiting or cats or something. Um, you know, just make something up. <laughs> um, you, can, you, can, uh, you can opt out or you, you just press, just say yes and then see, see what happens. So I'm excited about this. This is really cool because now say if you're going to visit some, somewhere, you can search, search, search the database, see if there's anybody there and you know maybe find a place to a couch to crash on and someone to hang out with while you're visiting so i also included a online safety information page just in case because we have to remember that we don't always know who we're talking to when we're talking online so it's important to be careful and now i'm just going to show you a little bit about what the page actually looks like so if you are a hooper and you're traveling somewhere and would like to stay with another hooper and would like to search the directory. To do that, just go to the Hoopers link and choose Homestay Project. Whoops, I definitely clicked on the Twitter one. There we go. And it'll pull, pull up the Homestay Project. There's some basic information about the project. And there is a link to meeting people on the internet and how to be safe about that. So definitely check that out. And then when you go to do your search, we have three different categories we can search by female or male, we can search by country, we can also search by city and state. So first off, let's just try a search uh, just to see who's in the directory so far. So it's only been up for I think a day and a half or something, so not a whole lot of people. We've got 16 people. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good. And if we want to say narrow it down to go something like Edmonton, we can search. And we've got two people. Oh, one. Now I know that Farron lives in Edmonton, so what happens if I just put Edmonton? Now we've got two people. So one thing to remember is that if you're searching, when you type something out, think about if there's a potential a potential different way to write it. So for example, California, you could search like that, or you could search like that. And depending on how people fill out their profile information when they log in, it might be very different. So try out a couple of different ways to get the best results and see see who, sh who shows up. Send them off a message and let them know the dates of when you'll be in town and see if they're interested in helping you out. Now if you are interested in participating in this and being listed in the directory, it's really easy. Just click on this, this link here to edit your profile details. It'll go right to your settings, scroll right to the bottom and choose yes. Now by default it is on the neutral or no answer. So if you don't go and answer this, you're, you're not going to be included in the directory and you won't have to worry about people contacting you. If you do want to be in the directory, just go and click yes, choose save, and you will be added to that listing. Now give it a little bit of time, um, so don't necessarily go and, and immediately search for yourself because you might not come up. It does take about 10 to 15 minutes for it to refresh and for you to be included in the directory. Yeah, so um, that's pretty cool, I think, maybe. So if you enjoy it, please feel free to comment and 
I hope that I hope that some of you guys can really benefit from this and have a great vacation because of it. A lot of the times it's difficult for us to travel and as women it can be a little bit intimidating so it might be much nicer for us to have somebody to hang out with when we when we leave our home. See ya!